Hey everybody, we're back to give you our third day in a row update of what's going on with our incubating eggs. Are you ready? Yeah, we were born ready. Okay, here we go. On the outside, our eggs look pretty much the same as they did yesterday, but on the inside, those little cells are making big progress. On day three of incubation, if we were able to see inside that egg, we could see a visible head and tail. Also, the leg and wing buds can also be seen starting to form. Other things going on in there, the tongue, liver, kidneys, and lungs are all beginning to form and lots more blood vessels are taking shape as well. In a couple of days, we're going to do something called candling the egg to see uh, inside of it so that we can see if these eggs are actually turning into chicks. So to give you an idea what that might look like, so this is an egg that somebody candled uh, at about three days in. Now, it's not recommended to candle eggs this, this soon because you have to move the eggs too much. This person did it just for demonstration purposes, and um, so we're, we're not going to try to candle our eggs this soon. We're going to wait till there's more to see. But you can see they put a light underneath the egg, and you can see here's the air cell that we talked about on the first day video, and here's the yolk at this part of the egg. All right, and so you can see there are some changes going on inside the egg as that chicken starts to develop. Now, in a later video, we're going to talk about the difference between the fertilized eggs that we're, we have inside of our incubator and eggs that you buy in the grocery store. For now, I want to talk to you a little bit about how we size eggs, because you may have noticed when you buy a carton of eggs, uh, it has these different sizes written on it, such as medium, large, extra large, or you might have even seen jumbo eggs. The way that we do this is that they're, they're size based on how much they weigh for a dozen eggs. So instead of uh, weighing each egg individually, they do an average of what the entire dozen weighs. So you can see it goes anywhere from peewee, which I've never seen a dozen peewee eggs in a grocery store. You'll have to watch out for that. Those are 15 ounces for a dozen, smaller 18 ounces, medium or 21 ounces, and the most common one and probably the eggs you have in your refrigerator right now are large eggs, which are 24 ounces, going all the way up to a dozen of jumbo eggs are 30 ounces. I'll also say, as this chart shows, for most recipes when it calls for, say, two eggs to be added to make something, typically they're referring to large eggs, uh, and that's what the recipe is geared towards. All right, so that's a little bit about how we size eggs that are sold in the grocery store. Again, different than the eggs we have in our incubator. We're going to talk more about that very soon. Let's show you now what we did today as we were checking on our incubating eggs. So we realized that we were having a little bit too high of humidity inside of here. And so we thought we maybe uh, we added too much water into the channels in the bottom. Um, we're not really sure, but we realized that there is a plug right here that we can pull out to provide a little bit more ventilation. So our astronaut here is going to pull out the plug. Learning truly is a out of this world experience here. So go ahead, Lincoln, pull out the plug. And let's try that and we'll see if that helps the temperature stay down because it's running just a little bit warmer than we'd like. And uh, we'll also see if that helps uh, bring down the humidity just a little bit too. All right, there you go. Thanks for joining us again today. That's all we have for you today, but we'll see you again tomorrow. Wait, we need a joke. Oh, do you know any jokes? Yeah. Okay, let's hear it. Why did the chicken join the band? I don't know. Why did the chicken join a band? Because he already had drumsticks. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, boy, we've been spending way too much time together, haven't we? Yep. All right, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Ah.